things you'll need for this project are paintbrush, Mod Podge, a duty piece of white paper, your frame, a cutting, like a little cutting thing to help cut straighter lines, or scissors if you don't have that, and some paint chips. The first thing you're gonna do is measure your paper out to the size of your picture frame, and I've already done that. And then you're gonna take your cutter, and this is why I use a cutter, because it's a lot nicer and straighter lines. And I'm just gonna use that. Whoops. Use that to cut along my lines. And then I'm gonna do the same, whoops. Same thing over here. Okay, so you're gonna cut that out and I'll be back when I'm done. With that done, you're gonna take your frame and make sure it fits. Fits perfectly fine. You want some paint samples, and if you do not have paint samples from the store, here are some that I printed off from the internet and cut out already. So I'm gonna use these for this project, and we're gonna make a calendar using paints. This is gonna be really fun, so I'm really excited. So yeah, this is also good for the school part or whatever you want. So yeah, printed these off, and of course you're only needing you need five um, colors or whatever for the five days of the week. But anyway, it's okay. It doesn't really matter, so I'm just gonna do this. So, you're also going to want to choose your colors, so I'm going to do that and lay that out for y'all to show you guys how it kind of works and what it's going to look like once it's done. For me, it's perfect because I just want to do Monday through Friday. I don't want to do the weekends. And I have five, five um, color rows, and then I have five, um, five colors across. So, it works perfectly fine for me, but that's just something that you're going to have to make sure it works for you once you get yours on there and stuff. So I've chosen for my calendar. I want to take them, and I don't want the little white things on them, So, but I want five um, colors, so I'm not going to use the darker one, darkest one, and this one, so I'm going to cut off the two bottom colors, um, because I only need one, two, three, four, five, and it's easier to light on the lighter one than the darker one, so yeah. So I'm going to cut off the two bottom ones for my calendar. Bottoms of all the colors. You can keep these if you want, but it's up to you. So here's the part that you want, all of the things. And for me, I'm going to actually cut off the little white sections in between. But if you do not want to do that, you don't have to. After I've not, I've not glued it, I just laid them all out. So here's what it looks like once it's done laying them out. I was gluing on the pieces, so I take my Mod Podge, and I take a paintbrush, and I take my next color, and I paint on a thin... A thin, nice thin coating of Mod Podge onto the piece of paper that I have. And then I want to stick that straight down onto my piece of paper, like so. So I've stuck in that on like that. So now I'm going to go into blue and do the same thing. So, of course, you're going to want to paint on stuck that on and then just going to stick on that blue and do the same for all the rest. So. Of course, purple's next. So I'm just going to again paint on my Mod Podge. And stick it on. The 
to it like that. So now I have all the bottom layer like that. There you have it. And now we're going to do the next layer. So I'm going to keep going and I'm going to show you guys what it looks like after I've finished a couple more rows. This is the finished product. And I'm not going to show you guys the money to take part, but I'm just going to show you guys what to do now. So I'm just going to put it in my beautiful frame that I have here. Because it's going to be a whiteboard. And I'm going to make sure you have this in the right area. Voila! Here you have a really cute DIY calendar. So you have a calendar. So I hope you guys enjoy. And hope you guys stay tuned for more. And bye! And this is DIY Crafts. So subscribe and comment to my, subscribe to my channel. Like the video to spread the word about craftiness. And yeah. And still hope you guys stay organized for school or for whatever you want to stay organized for. Yeah. Bye. Love y'all.